Hey everybody, what's up? It's Dom here. We're going to be talking about TW 2020 Total Extreme Wrestling. 2020 is right around the horizon here, about a month away from the official release. A long time coming, four years in the making. But we got some stuff to talk about here today. So with TW 2020 um, coming out very soon, guys, we got some stuff to decide what we're going to do, essentially. If I'm going to stream or record, do a little bit of both, have multiple series going on. I think the plan for me, honestly, right now is to have one series. Try to put it out every day, um, at least in terms of recording, maybe stream here and there also. A little bit of a mixture of both. But I really want like a long-term uh, save going on here. So I will be having some friends here with me, and my initial plan was probably to have something like a brand split but that kind of seems like generic the problem with tw is that even though it's a new game a lot of stuff has been done before i wanted to try to showcase some of the new mechanics like playing as the uh, developmental companies and i think that would probably be best to do in a like AEW versus wwe with nxt scenario so essentially have someone be WWE, but then they also have uh, another person be NXT and they have to work alongside them. The problem being is that WWE has like a bajillion shows to book too though. So it might be a thing of like maybe that NXT person has like a group that works with them and then they have to also fight off from WWE taking the people on the main roster. Also not every database is including NXT as a developmental company right now too. So we have to see like what uh, database to use. Um, of course, we have stuff like we could do Impact versus AEW and NXT and WWE. Like, how would they fare in like today's wrestling society? Uh, we have modern day NWA is also looking interesting. Uh, we can go back in time also and just straight up do WCW versus WWF and take it long term. It's one of the best uh, databases there is with the 1997 Montreal Prelude and Aftermath. So I think doing a long term save with that might be ideal, honestly. Um, ECW is another one, another what if series if they live, but I feel like that's been done before too. So it's just another one of those things where like how I can put my twist on things. I feel like I've always done best when it comes to like Impact and TNA, um, but with TW 2020 in the main features, I think AEW is probably going to be the strong uh, suite here to follow. Um, of course, Ruthless Aggression, that era with like 2004 and WWE, TNA, not bad there. 2014 also has a pretty good database for long term, but I think honestly, if I'm not doing something between 1997 and 2001 from those databases made by uh, Gennady and the Mod Squad, then I'm looking more towards like modern day with like Flash or the Who essentially uh, with AEW and NXT. But it's up to you guys here, and I'm going to let you guys vote and pretty much figure out uh, what you guys would like to see. Um, with that being said, guys, probably head back to this in a couple weeks right before the game comes out or the demo comes out and uh, we'll see what we're gonna do other than everybody until next time peace out